Well, howdy there, folks. This is your host, ID Jester, and yes, we're back for some more Horizon beta action here. This is a 4X turn based strategy game. Uh, again, this is beta down here, it's version 4.61. So again, some of these options that um, some of these things in the game might not be included right now. Uh, they might be changed, altered, whatever. Uh, it is beta. So far, I found the beta to be very stable. I haven't had any crashes or any issues that way. Um, let's continue. Hopefully, you've been able to check out our previous couple episodes there, where we're doing a let's look at Horizon and trying to figure out exactly what this game can do and what it's like. And so um, that's what we're going to do. We'll just hit our continue button and see where we are and get to figure out exactly where everything lies. Okay, so here we were. Okay, this is uh, picked up from last day, last night actually. We we're trying to figure out. I actually got in the manual and was looking around to see if I could figure out the range for these different vehicles. Um, I know when you click on colony ships, it gives you some options there. That seems to be a lot different now than it looked before, but okay. Um, and unfortunately, we've been scouring around, scouring the universe, trying to find some habitable planets and the only thing we found so far is these over here in Tashir Tashir 3 which was a very good planet for us to pick up I believe it's a huge planet uh, so we have four turns left before we can actually get it to be a colony and so uh, I believe let's see if there's any other news I didn't see any news so let's go ahead and just pick up where we were. Let's just make sure all of our ships are surveying or moving. Okay, good. Let's end the turn there. All right, that was kind of a boring turn. Not a lot happened. You notice that nothing popped up on our little menu here. All right, so next turn. Oh, what do we have here? We got something. Looks like we met another race here. Many greetings, a new neighbor. All right. We have made first contact with the Bar Bex. Diplomatic channels have been established. We're exploring the Lure system and the Jianja system. All right, so oh, this is where it looks like. Oh, wow, Arctic. Um, I'm not sure what that is, and a gas giant. That's interesting. When they have colonized that planet, it doesn't actually tell you in that screen what it is. So yeah, that's something I would hope they would fix eventually. Um, I think it's important to know what kind of planet it is. So this is Arctic, that's just defended. <laughs> and that's a glass gas giant. So yeah, like I was saying, I was looking through the manual before we restarted today. And oh look, we got three trade routes going back and forth there. We are only getting a net income of 43 million. Well, that's not good. We need to do something about that. So we have... Uh, we only have 1.2 billion credits in our treasury. We're getting a 668 million. We have 1.17 BC in maintenance. Trade Center Capital, Pod Racing Arena, Hydroproduct Farms, Factories, and Research Labs. Two, three, oh, that's the capitals. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 
Yeah, it's about 11.17. Okay, so if I add all that stuff up, it looks like it's our net income. Our workforce is up to 6.13 billion. Okay. We can't upgrade anything there. We have got no money. And uh, we're still got 25 turns left on that cruiser. Okay. Was there anything else I wanted to look at? Nope. Okay. Holy cow, look at that. That's a lot of news. So, finish surveying, finish surveying, finish surveying. Whole bunch of things surveyed. We have this guy that's waiting on news. We have a gas giant, Baron, Baron Poor, of course. Let's go survey that. Who else needed basic scout awaiting new orders? Or, whoa, he's got a lot of ships in there. Can we tell what kind of ships they are? Click on them, right click. All right, well, let's give this ship orders. Might as well head out that way. So he's got quite a few little ships in there. Hmm. That's going to be a problem. Unless they're all... Let's see if there's a way to look at... Oops. Sector engaged. Engaged sector. Nope. I don't think I want to do that. Okay. Alright, what else do we have here? Basic scout awaiting orders. This guy's done. Uh, let's see. This system. Karas 1. Karas 2. No good, no good. This one was no good, no good. That's our system. Have we looked at this one? Nope. Unexplored. How about that one? Yep. A barren, volcanic. Oceanics, but it does have gold deposits, volcanic, gas, volcanic, toxic, Terran. Abundant resources. Low pollution. Hmm. Well, we could send one over there, but we've got three ships that are trucking along over there for... All right, let's see you. Let's give you orders. We don't know what that is. We don't know what that is. That's three turns. That's three turns. Unexplored system F. Um, hmm. Six turns, yeah. All right, start heading out there. Where is our? This is our ship here. Yes, this is our basic scout E two, which is the engine upgrade. So, colony ship built on Tushar three. What? I did not mean to do that. Yikes. I bet you I was messing around on things and clicked on it. Ah. Uh, huh. That's kind of a bummer. Can we build this? Nope. Um, let's see. We need more money trade. Sure. Let's start building that. I'm not sure why we build a colony ship unless we were trying different things. Scout. Alright, so he finally arrived at this destination. Uh, let's see. Gas, metallic, barren, desert, desert, Terran. Oh, we got a chance of getting this one. We have to wait for it to be... Which is good, because we got a colony ship in there. Now we have... Colony built. 
Oh, that's a colony build, not the colony ship. Uh, duh. Okay, so I was thinking it was a colony ship as opposed to a colony. So now that we've got spent our five turns, we've got a colony here. Now we can start doing things with our colony, making upgrades to it, uh, having it build us things. Um, wow, we're losing money now. Okay, well, let's see if we can... Request to open communications, all right? Greetings, you're curious new people. We look forward to learning from you. The Hakan Unification. They look like, um, like crystallized race made of crystals and glass and stuff like that. That's cool. All right, let's actually go into our races screen here and see what we know about things. Out of communication range, out of communication range, out of, okay. So what we need to do is get to our text here. Oh, we got one more turn left. That's what I was looking for. Interstellar comms, okay. So let's go ahead and... Uh-oh, relations with the Hakan have taken a turn for the worst as hostilities reach a new level. Hakan, I believe, yes, that's the pink one. Oh, what? What? What did they settle here? A large metallic planet. Fertile soil. Large population. Ooh, that's not... That's not good. They like the metallic worlds. Well, they're crystallized. Crystalline. Alright, well, again, I wish they would have... <clears throat> tell you what's being surveyed in this system would be helpful. Um, small Terran planet. Mm. You're still headed out that way. You're still... Okay, you should be done with that by now, Nis. No? All right, end our turn. There we go. Faster than light, Tractheon particles makes real-time communication possible over vast distances. This allows conductive, secure, diplomatic communications, as well as giving orders to our task force while in transit. Range to sectors. Uh, in an anomaly's 10% range bonus. Okay, so two sectors. Uh, oh, oh, the Deho system here, okay. Alright, so you'll notice that now we have these little, like, little blue things around our worlds, and if anything falls within there, we can communicate with it. So we can now actually talk to the Hakons. Shall we talk with the Hakons? Communicate. These are little crystalline people. Let's offer a friendly greeting. Hello there. Why do humans have such a need to look upon others with such reg regularity? Uh, make an offer. Now make um propose a treaty. How about a non-aggression pack? No. Uh, make a demand, make an offer, make a declaration. No. Wow, not a lot of options there. Propose a treaty. But she said no. Yeah. Make a demand. Demand a tribute from them. Give us a tech. Remove your ships. Surrender the system. Or cancel. Okay, make an offer. Offer tribute. Offer system. Offer technology. Cancel. Threaten. Terminate all hostilities. 
or we can enter communication. That's some of the things we can do. I wanted to look at that and see. So, um, these guys should be friendly with us, but they're not. That's kind of, that's kind of bad, actually. This hasn't been surveyed yet. Come on, what the heck are you doing, survey ship? Or scout? You're waiting orders. How about you s survey planet that one? zero turns yep I need to find out if our colony ship can do anything with that and this guy is outside our range so we can't communicate with them so just inside that little border now alright so let's look at our text again here <sighs> we're at level one it only take us um, let's right click this it would give us three range on our communications. Hmm. Let's take that off for now. Let's see what else we have here. Titanium armor. combat suit. So this must be for ships. So let's let's focus in on getting the ship one done. And we can knock it down to two turns. Sounds good. Okay. So is there anything in that system? No. So let's let's see how easy it is to find planets hmm type we want for type we want Terran okay so this one needs a survey that's huge abundant we yeah, we already have that one that is large and poor, which is yeah, that's the other one in the system. And we have Earth, Katarian Seven. Where the hell is that? Oh, this guy here, really? Seven. Yeah, it didn't matter because it's it's not ours to uh, can't colonize it because he's already on that. Look at that. He's got two in the same system. Oh my gosh. That is a medium Terran. That would have been nice to get, but okay. Well... All right, it's in the turn. See how we go. Oh, okay, dokie. What do we got going on here? Is is this the combat system? What is this? Uh-oh. What the hell is he having here? We should have another... There is our planet we want. So let's... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute.
Miss, miss. Okay. So they're attacking us. Why are they attacking us? We didn't do anything. Well, all we have is a colonizer ship. Really? Can we like that? Wow, it's this looks like Earth here. They've All right, shoot it. Whatever, shoot. You're gonna die. It doesn't matter. You might as well try to shoot. They are just blowing it to hell. the hell is this thing? okay Why didn't I have access to this guy before? I guess is my question. Right, so you can right click and you can start heading towards a certain direction. Let's right click here. Go to the next guy. We'll just right click over here. Why is he going the wrong way? Oh, done. That's the guy I meant to go up there. Done. Okay, this needs um, this needs a little bit of work. There's no way to scroll in and out, so I'm using my scroll button in and out. Looks like it could be pretty cool, but um, this is just too much little stuff. You can't see where you're really going to without zooming out. So, go. You go up here. I have no idea what I'm doing right now, so let's just how to resolve. Yep, I see that. Okay, so you've declared war on us. See that. I see you have declared war on us. Here's the problem I have with this. The problem I have on this is because I moved my ships around and then all of a sudden I'm under attack without any kind of warning ahead of time. What should happen is this message should come up first and say, hey, we're at war, we declare war on you, blah blah blah, and then we should have the ship battles. I shouldn't have to sit there and try to figure out what was going on until I know what what had happened. If this guy declared war or whatever. So this should have come up first. Then we should have had the ship battles. So hopefully they'll fix that. So you suck, uh, little dude. 
Alright, this is our top story. Inevitable has been. It was hoped the Earth Alliance and Hakun unification would settle their differences. Unfortunately, war between the two races has been declared. See, this should all happen before... There should be a turn where somebody declares war on you. Then the next turn they can attack. It should not be the other way around. This is my feeling. I know I've watched some videos in other game series and other different things where uh, this same situation happened where the person was playing the game and then all of a sudden his units become under attack. I think it was like um, Legendary Heroes or something similar to that. Anyways, uh, his units got under attack and... He didn't know what was happening, and then all of a sudden, after all the attacks happened, then the message came up on the screen that said, Oh, yeah, by the way, we declare war on you. So, this needs to be fixed. I think you should have to declare war, and then the next turn, you can actually attack units. Um, or at least, the, the bare minimum, you should have it declare war, you should have the message come up, blah, 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 and then have all the attacks happen from the ships. This should not be this way. Hopefully they will fix that because that's very annoying to me. So our colonizer has been destroyed and that's in our home system. They have opened fire on us and this guy awaiting new orders. Scout 2. Well, how about Scout 2? You move back home to protect our home no not the colonizer scout two orders move colonizer you uh, colonizer waiting orders okay that's because I'm waiting for did we get the scan of this thing yet Requires a survey. I wonder if I can colonize it without a survey. Let's see. Orders. Uh, colonize. Bam. You. Orders. Patrol. Okay, patrol. No, I don't want to patrol. I want to... Orders, move, patrol, orbit, just orbit there. Yeah, we're going to get our asses handed to us severely because we've got nothing going on right now. We do have a cruiser that's being built. It's only going to take us 19 turns to build it. This guy, what are you doing? Orders. Oh, you are just got done, I believe, right? Oops. Wrong button. Basic scout. Okay, there it is. Right there. Um, you, move. Uh, you, survey. So we'll survey that one, we'll survey that one. What do we have here? Anything yet? This is... T-42. Let's see what T-42 has to say. It's surveying, okay. Established a new outpost, great. Titanium armor, colonizer, oops, all right, colonizer, so you dropped off your pods, it's time to move back here, who else do we have, basic scout, 
Where'd he go? T14. He's, he should orbit. There we go. We'll orbit that. Hi, hi, hi. All right. What else do we have happen? Text. Yes. So we can take it off of armor now because we got our armor. We're at level two now. Advanced waste disposal reduces pollution. Deadly biological weapons that can be used to exterminate colonists in large numbers. Well, I think it's time to start upgrading our laser cannons. That's planetary bombardment. That's for uh, units that come down. Nuclear missiles. And there we go. So laser, ca laser cannons. We're just going to upgrade the shit out of that. We'll see how they like that. Alright. Anything else? Our can have 72 expansion. Barbic is 51. Katuri is 51. And humans, 33. Ouch. Well, we haven't had very good uh, explored the system. Gas giant, metallic, okay. And that's just a black hole, nothing special. I haven't really figured out what these guys do, what that does yet. Um, do we know this? No, might as well go out there. Or better yet. Hmm. Maybe we want to keep that guy closer to home here. Send him back home. like to take out this system here. Ha ha ha. It is purple we're after, right? Let's just double check here. Yeah, the Harkon. Okay. Is it worth investigating this little star? Or should we just... Um, sure, let's just go ahead. I don't think one little scout's gonna do much if he comes in with a bunch of a bunch of dudes. Nothing happened that turn. All right, so we're starting to look at this system, barren, desert, toxic, Arctic gas giant, Arctic gas giant. So nothing at all that we can do. This guy's taking his sweet time about getting over there. This guy made it here much faster. Alright, let's move. Let's move back to... that planet there. Start protecting it. Terran Tashin Tashin 3. Oops. 3, there you go. Okay, I think it's time to start. Oh, we can't build anything because we've got no money. Got two turns left to get this trade. How much did that cost to buy it? 60 million credits. Sure, let's do it. 
and how much does this cost? Okay, it'll give us some extra tourism. So we need money. So everybody doing something? Nope. Basic scout over here. Okay, I told you to orbit that planet. That's all I want you to do is just sit there. Oh, actually, you know what? Um, click to continue. That's fine. Okay, we got to wait five turns for that to come online. I forgot about that. Still remembering how to play, folks. Still figuring out how to play. And we're getting our asses handed to us, it looks like. Basic Scout has arrived. What? Basic Scout has arrived in orbit. Racing Arena and the Trader has both been built. And then I think, oh, hell no. He's got guys in our system. What? Um, okay, well. Can I buy a, s let's go in and design a scout. Let's see here, laser cannons. Uh, it's got zero available space, that's right. We do have our nuclear missile scout, but basic scout. Alright, that's fine. Nine turns, holy Moses. I think we're almost out of money, too. We're losing money. Oh my gosh, come on, baby. Tourism plus 14, and trader income plus 10. So we're getting a little bit better. Uh, so all of our guys moving. Yeah, well, you should be just orbiting. Laser cannons. There we go. Tex. So we can take it out of weapons. Let's see what that has to say. So up to 10 to 15 damage. Now the question is, let's look at this. It'll be interesting to see here. Um, because we've upgraded our engine or our laser cannons, let's look at our ships. So you have a basic scout. Um, can I look at it? No, I can't look at it, can I? I had to actually click on it this way, I think. Oh, there it is. Okay, so our basic scout. It's got level one of everything. Yep. Okay, so if I go and actually... Where were, was it? We were just building a scout. Right here in Toshin 3, right? Oops. Passion 3, basic scout, let's design, basic scout E, let's look at scout 3 here, lasers level 2, that's what I wanted to see, okay, so what we'll do is we'll rename this, scout L2 for laser 2. And we'll save that. Return. On this, we will actually... Okay. Phew. I don't really want to buy it, but I'm going to have to because we got guys in our sector. I don't want them doing something in my little...
planet there until I say so. So this guy's headed home. That guy should still be orbiting. I don't like the fact that this scout here, we've told it to orbit this planet. It should just keep orbiting it until I change my mind. So hopefully, again, they'll fix some of that issue there. Because um, every turn it pops up and says he's awaiting orders. If uh, I just wanted you to keep orbiting that system there until I change my mind. Uh, so that's done. What did we change our tech to? I forget. Uh, we didn't actually change it yet, did we? Ground combat. Armor planes for ground combat. Ground combat. Ground combat. Boy, there's a lot of stuff for ground combat. Man, that must be big in this game. Raises the efficiency of industrial production. 797 turns. Yeah. Life support. Protection and conditions to sustain life in space and hostile environments. Construction. We haven't done anything with the construction recently, so let's, let's put a few turns into construction here. Okay. Scout has been built. All right, let's engage the sector. So basically you're saying um, all the sector engagements happen in between turns. So basically when you click the end of the turn button, you'll then have your sector engagements. And basically what happens in a sector engagement, and I haven't actually done it other than when we had that surprise attack, <clears throat> but basically you get 20 turns of combat. At the end of 20 turns, it will go back to just, uh, it'll move on to the next turn. So, uh, yeah. So let's look at our little scout here. It should be, there it is, titanium armor, level two. And it's got nuclear engines, level two. And it's got level two lasers. All right, so we will click on the engage sector. So in between turns, we will engage with this Hakon, Hakon, whatever the hell it is. We're going to try and blow up our first ship ever. So this is kind of interesting. You see this line here. This, this one line here that comes from this point, it's all red. You see little ships going back and forth. This one here is like half red, half green. So I wonder, does that mean it's a... Miner? Okay, so we don't need the miner. That's local trade routes. Majors. Nothing goes on or off there. So I'm not sure why that's half red, half green. Hmm... Well, we'll figure it out. All right. Um. So, what was I doing now? Yes. Yeah, so we're gonna engage the sector. Um. Let's go back into Tashin Three here and start building another scout in case this one fails. This guy's still huffing back. This guy. Uh. We can't enter. We can't talk to him. Too bad. We got guys coming back to our system here. What's this? What's this building? Uh, it's still got two turns before it becomes a colony. Okay, let's see what happens. All right, so here we are. Let's see what we got here. This must be us. And again, I'm trying to zoom in and out, but I can't. So this shows you how many little quadrants you can move. So each one of these blocks must be broken up into maybe a 5x5 five five or 6x6 six six grid. Where is the enemy? Should be this red dot here, shouldn't he? Oh, there he is. 
All right, so we're going to right click on it and start heading over there. So that was our move to come this way. So we'll be done. Let's see, he warped over to us and shot at us. And um, to tell us what happened during the round. Okay, this is your round number and this is your initiative. Higher initiative, I believe, goes first. That's your auto mode. It's your different speeds. All right, so we have. We're here doing this for the protection of our home world. So let's uh, see if we can miss. And he did 11 damage. Okay. See, that should be. There should be somewhere a report, like a round by round report, so you know what the hell happened. Uh, test force lock. Let's see here. It's rearming, rearming. What's this say? Specials. Uh, that's weapons. That's specials. Okay. Um, miss. 15 damage. What? Ah. Oh, we only got one shot now because our other way damage our other laser is damaged. So he is. Oh, okay. So he's shooting us through this. So what we should have done is moved. So he couldn't shot through. He's going to shoot through the same sector. I got it. Yep, that's bad for us. Okay, so definitely front shields are damaged. Uh, let's move over here and then shoot. Oh, you can't move and shoot. What? Our, both our... Both our cannons are damaged. Unbelievable. Can we find out any inf Oh, okay. So we, that's how we can turn. Well, um... Yeah. So both of our lasers are damaged. He has got shields. Hmm. <sighs> Not good, folks. Not good at all. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, can we run? <laughs> can we disengage the target? Yeah, what do you want to do? Tosh in three system belongs to us. We demand that you return it immediately. Oh, my gosh. Tosh in three is the only good system we have. Refuse. All right. Yeah, you're going to have to wipe us off the face of the earth. Yeah, literally. <laughs> ah, Tenson system, which is a barren and volcanic. Boy, I'll tell you what. We haven't got uh, anything here. Scout has been destroyed. Uh, basic Scout has explored this system here. All right, let's see what we got. Gas, Toctic, Metal, Gas, Arctic, Gas, Gas. Wow. All right, well, orders move four turns. Okay. Move it. Uh, again, I don't know which one of these have been surveyed already, unless I look at my little list. Yes. Uh, open fired on us. Yes, we know. Colony built. All right. Treasury is going down fast. We need something for money. And entertainment does tourism. I believe. All right. Surveying terrace. One, Terrace, two, 
terrorists is no good. Oh my gosh, these systems have been <laughs> crap. Alright, orders, survey. We already did this one. Uh, Alright. Oops, that's right. We already did that. So we have to click on it again. Orders, move. Move everybody back here. Where is our cruiser? Aren't we building a cruiser? Where is our... Are we building it on Earth? Is that what we're doing? Still got nine turns left. Okay. That should help, really. I think it should. We can move our cruiser over here next to this planet, or into this system. We'll get a... We'll get do something. We got a couple... We got three scout ships coming back. Gonna protect our three little worlds we own, and, and we'll see how it goes from there. Nothing happened. Life support. Alright, that gives us... Sustained life in space and hostile environments, which gives us... Protection tier 2 bonus, boarding defense, power usage 1% of maximum power, cost 5% of hull size. Okay. Not sure exactly what all that means right now, but. Hmm. Targeting system. That sounds like a big one. Electronics. Let's go back in. See if we can focus in on that for a little bit. <sighs> All right, folks, I'm going to bring this episode to a close. Thanks for watching. Again, this is Beta of Horizon 4X strategy game. Uh, you can pick it up on Steam for about uh, 25 bucks right now. And uh, definitely think this has got a lot going for it. And hopefully they'll continue... Uh, looking at it and adding things to it and making it that much better. So um, we'll see you next time, folks. Thanks for watching.